Sup kids, the universe is heading towards its inevitable heat death, where particles will be separated forever by increasingly expanding space between them. But while that's happening, you might as well sit down and watch this video, because otherwise your particles are going to be the only ones at the end of the universe who haven't seen this particular Tatiana video. And frankly, those particles sound like losers. I'm going to have to sit like this for the rest of the video, because this is the only place I can put my camera that gave me more desk space for this video. So don't you go looking down my top, you pervs. And yes, I'm fully aware I'm wearing opera gloves with a t-shirt. Why don't you leave a comment down below about how much of a whiny bitch you are? Alright, let's crack this shit open. I of course want to say thank you firstly to everyone that sent me mail for this first time. Remember a little while ago I did have a lot of problems with it, so originally I opened a P.O. box, which basically only letters could make it into the P.O. box, unless it was sent like in UK borders, you could send parcels inside the UK but you couldn't- <laughs> Fuck. Eventually I managed to find another mailbox outside of my town which did accept all particles and I have been getting some mail so we have some stuff to open now. Wow this oh, this knife isn't sharp. Mm, but my hands aren't sharp either so I mean it's better than nothing. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah holy shit. So, oh god, oh no, it's not going to focus. I'm probably going to scan these in so you can see them a bit better, but... Oh, holy shit. Right, I can't actually read this in this light, so give me a minute. <laughs> so I'm Foji, and I'm kind of the typical art student. I also really enjoy drawing you. Even too, I'm scared it'll be a, a little annoying if I keep doing it. No, no, keep keep drawing me. Holy, holy shit. Oh, that's so nice. I should get an outfit like that. Fuck. I've also sent you googly eyes. If you could put it on a funny object and give it a name for me, I would really like that. Why? Honestly, why not? So This one, I've got no idea who sent me this one because it's clearly from Amazon and there's two stickers. There's the one Amazon put on after it's arrived in the UK and then there's a one that's completely in Chinese underneath this, so who knows what we're getting? Literally anything. What's important is I'm going to stab it violently. Welcome back to knife opening ASMR. Oh, I know what this is. Saint Justy, Versalis Rose on Twitter sent this to me. Thank you very much. So this is a gothic style dress. I don't know, I, think, I feel like it's shorter than I thought it would be, but there you go, I'm gonna try that one a bit. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna be honest, it's a nice looking dress from like, the waist up, but it's a little bit too small. I mean it says medium on the packet, but this is definitely a small, like I'm a guy, I don't have hips, and I struggled to pull this over my ass. Is that a problem with the size of the dress, or the size of my ass? Who can really tell? Which is a shame, because I genuinely would have worn this, this is like, this, is a, this looks really nice. <laughs> yeah, if people want to just send me stuff from Amazon, that's totally cool and everything, it doesn't have to be like a personalised thing, if, it's just whatever people want to send me, so if you do just want to go on Amazon and buy something from them, totally fine, just do that. So this one's from Germany, and it is suspiciously shaped. I'm going to start stabbing into it where there's already a hole. That's always a good sign. Okay, we're just gonna rip this with our bare hands. Oh, tap strength. Why does this smell delicious? Like this smells suspiciously good. It's got a little, st it's got a little ink stamp on it. The hell, guys? We're getting fancy up in here. I mean, this is entirely in German, but it says vegan on it. I have no idea what that is. What is this? <laughs> oh, I think that's the thing that smells though. Mm. Hi Tati, I thought I should finally send you the drawing I made. So here it is. Oh, here we go. So, yeah, so the bath salt. That explains why it smells nice. Drawing, obviously. There's another soap here. I thought this was something I, I was going to bite into this just to see what it is. But it's soap now, and, but I'm not going to do it now. And here's some little shoes. I wonder if I can scan them in, I could put them on the Discord server actually. As actual, like, um, as actual emotes and stuff. That would be pretty cool. So this is from Amy Sola, thank you very much. Yeah, we, I saw this artwork we did a long time ago now, months ago. Ah! Mm! Bam! Look at that! That's lovely! 
I'm gonna put this somewhere because it's already framed. Haha! -ha. That's a free frame. Except that one's out of frame. <clears throat> should I should I cut into this like one of those soap cutting videos online that are really popular? With my knife? Oh shit, fuck me. Oh yeah, but you like like that, don't you? Oh yeah. I bet someone's masturbating to this. No, nope, I'm really trying to get an erection from this, but I'm just not getting it. Okay, now this one's come all the way from Australia, which you can tell by this. Okay, that's how you write it. I'll put it up on screen as well so you can see it a bit clearly. But if you want to send anything to the P.O. box... P.O. No, it's not a P.O. box. It's a mailbox. It's different. Legally distinct. If you want to send anything to the mailbox, use this address and use it exactly like that. If you have to fill it out on Amazon or other websites and stuff, it's address line one, address line two. So box is address line one and then the next line is the... Uh, 91 Western Road. If you do feel like sending anything, thank you very much for sending stuff. Um, I'm gonna continue doing these box, you know, openings and everything like that um, every now and again uh, if people keep sending stuff. So it's just a little fun thing to do, I guess, if you want to send me anything. It's also a great place to unload your old clothes that you don't want anymore, but you'd like to see me wear. So I'm a medium if you want to send me anything. Remember, when you're using a knife, always cut towards yourself. This box is actually incredibly difficult to open. Well done. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Bam. I mean, this is packed. This is... Bam. It's a little teacup. And it fucking says Tatiana on the bottom. What the fuck? That's... Oh, that's so good. <laughs> mm. Mm. I am so glad I dug around in this box because there's a letter. <laughs> that was not clear. Greetings from across the pond. I don't know if you drink tea, but considering you're British, I thought I'd give it a go. Wow, racism already. I've made you a pair of stealth teacups. If anyone ever asked you about them, if they end up in the wash, you can say the name on the bottom is the maker. Sweet Bee Urban Pottery. Thank you very much, Casey. Where the fuck am I gonna put all this shit now? I hope everyone realises my room may seem tidy that way, but that's because I just moved the junk from this side to this bit here, which um, every time I record a video. So if I just start stomping my foot here, there's a lot more crap over here than you'd expect. Thanks to everyone that sent stuff. It's, it's really nice to actually see that people are interested enough to send me stuff. Again, um, here's the address if anyone wants to send anything, literally anything, I don't care what it is. If you just want to send me a letter, that's absolutely fine. I'd love to see them, I'd love to read them. I'd love to see and read them, specifically in that order. And I have had a few people message me saying if they can send me old clothes. Uh, yeah, if you want to dump your old clothes on me, absolutely fine, as long as they fit. That's cool. And again, if you want to just send me stuff that you bought online, you just want to go on their website and put in the address and stuff and send it there, that's fine too. Uh, just let me know online and stuff uh, so I can know that you're the one that sent me it. This is obviously isn't going to be a big video, so I just want to wrap this up quickly. Uh, mainly just to give you a little update on some stuff, because I know not many people are going to really watch this one, just sort of people that are interested in my stuff rather than just the video content. You'll notice the video content has changed since I came back. Uh, I haven't done a Reddit video yet, for example. I did a, uh, I did a video about Reddit, and then I did um, the safety video uh, one, which everyone seemed to enjoy, which I'm really happy about. I'm kind of not happy with doing them anymore. There's no real place for me to sort of fit myself in. I might do like one, like randomly, but it's not gonna be the main content on this channel anymore. I'm glad you guys have enjoyed the last two videos and I really hope that you enjoy the future videos, which I now have to plan out because I've ran out of ideas. And it's content I'm happier making. Uh, it allows me to be a bit more creative with it. One thing I should mention is I am actually away in August, like just, I'm not in the country for the entire month and I will be again away for about a week into September or something so I'll be back on maybe the 10th of September and I'll be gone on the 4th of August. That's a really weird way of saying that, I should have said it the other way around. My point is I'm going away again for a month. I'm going to try and get a, a laptop and everything and then what I'm going to try and do is maybe rush record a bunch of stuff the week before I leave and maybe take some editing software with me and try and edit the videos there and try and upload them still. 
my other idea is of course to take a camcorder, which I'm going to be doing anyway, because I'll be I'll be at a film festival for the week in September where I'll be on a panel about constructed identities, and I intend to film a lot of that and kind of film my week there, but also after I'd already planned to do that, I then planned another trip to Amsterdam, the same place. So I'm going to be recording that and editing that together. And I know it's kind of going to be kind of weird with a vloggy bit in the middle of my channel, but like, I'm going to try and keep it as contained as possible to maybe two videos in that entire month and try and keep um, pumping out uh, commentary videos. So that's just a fair warning for the rest of the channel. But, you know, I'm really enjoying this content and I hope you guys uh, enjoy it too. I'll try to get back to normal videos next week. I'll see you next time, guys. See ya.